This is El Moro Pigeon Show. I am your host, El Moro. That's your hostess, Yaya Diamond. That's my wife. Now, today I'm going to be talking about something that I is not often talked about, uh, but is a new technology that can help your birds when they get an injury. For example, and my wife is going to tell you about this technology, but I'm going to tell you about this is the pigeon that got hit by the hawk. I put iodine there because she was like really bleeding. And I can tell it's her because there's still some iodine there, see? Okay, so her wing is kind of like, I don't know, she flies inside the loft. I haven't seen it flying outside, you know, but this one I can stretch it. This one, I don't know if I want to stretch it because I think she's a little like restricted there. So what we have for her today is something that is good for humans and for animals. And it's called a cold laser. Can you tell them about it? So the cold laser is like a red You want to sit down? No. Thank you. The cold laser is like a red therapy, but it has a laser component to it. And it, what it does is it, it actually helps with inflammation and any kind of injuries. Um, it also helps to rebuild fibers like cartilage and bring blood to areas that normally don't have blood circulation so that the area can be healed within itself so the body can heal that area. The blood is the reason why, the, like cartilage. There is no uh, blood circulation to cartilage like in your knees and your elbows. And so in the wing of a, of a bird, this is going to reduce inflammation. It's also going to bring the needed blood to the area and the circulation so that it can heal and, and not have any more pain and be fully and completely ready to execute whatever needs to execute. Yeah, and uh, I'm sorry to interrupt you. Yeah, but it really works because my knee, you know, because all the years of martial arts, it hurts a little bit, my hip, but when I do the laser, you know, and oh my gosh, it's, it's like night and day. And this cold laser, you can do it for like five minutes, 10 minutes. I'm gonna do the bird today for five minutes. It's the first time I do it. And this is not, uh, you want to get this in, because we're going to go yeah. over here. Uh, we're going to, while we do it, we're going to talk. This is not just a red light. This is a laser. Now, while you're doing it, you have to be careful not to, uh, you got to cover her eye. That way, she don't look at the laser. Okay, so usually, this comes with protected goggles, but because there's no protected goggles for her, I'm just going to cover her face. And my wife, uh, go ahead. No, but don't, don't, yeah, don't turn it on to me. Now, you can turn it on to them so they can see it because, okay, you see that? That is not a red light, that is a laser, okay? Now, what I want to do is I want you to open her wing slowly, okay? Do it in the joint right here. Okay, and we set it up for five minutes. You can set it up for 15 minutes. You can set it up for 20 minutes, right? Yeah, 20 and 30. Um, mm -hmm. Usually circulating five to 10 minutes on each spot. So five to 10 minutes on one spot would be the best thing that you can do. Um, and again, this takes away the uh, inflammation in the area and helps to circulate the blood there. And so this is a later, it laser. It can penetrate. Um, about three, two to three inches inside, depending on how close you get the laser. With this here, it's going all the way to the other side. Yeah, I figure that, you know, I mean, just, it's a bird, just so little, so I figure we do five minutes only. But I, I wanted to do under too. Yeah, you can do this for you guys, also even with clothes on. Yeah, with thin clothes. Thin clothes. If the clothes is too, uh, yeah, but she's got feathers on. And it's just two to three inches through. Okay. Yeah, for example, if you do it on your knee, uh, you can do it with your clothes on. If it's a, a thin clothes, on your shoulder, you know? But do, do it on there, do it on there. I, I want to pick up, yeah. Yeah, see, so now we're picking up the wing and we're going on there. I don't want to look at it because it's not a red light, guys. It's a laser. It's a cold laser. And this is wonderful 
for dogs too, you know. Yeah, animals and humans alike. Animals and humans. This is new technology for us. I don't know how long it's been. I'm <laughs> sure that it's been around. But uh, you can buy this where? Tell them about where they can buy it. Um, I'll put the link in the description box below so that it'll be easy for you guys to go ahead and grab that yourselves. They are bigger. They are machines, right? They are very big machines. This is a small handheld. Um, and the bigger machines, of course, uh, you can step into them. Uh, just make sure that they are medically graded and that their uh, uh, RMFs are low. What is RMF? The radiation. Okay. So it's actually it's radiation. Yeah, she's uh, she's gonna feel a lot better. Oh yeah. And as you notice, I'm covering her head. See, that way she don't look at it. Okay. Now I, I'm looking at it to to there. Is that bad? No, that's fine. Oh, okay. You can't look directly. It's, it's usually so you don't put it directly on your face. Mm. So if you're if you have any scarring on your face or any facial um, uh, inflammation stuff like that, your tooth is hurting. Literally, you just put on uh, maybe some blinders um, so that it doesn't get in your eyes. So basically, it's just for your face. You can look at the laser. They don't suggest you look at it for a long period of time. It's like looking at the sun for a long time. Don't do that. Um, you can glare at it to make sure it's in the right spot. But at the same time, go ahead and look away. Basically, if you have any inflammation on your face, it's really good. So just put on some uh, protective eyeglasses. I really, I really like, you know, those, um, those uh, blinders that you can wear at nighttime? Yeah. <laughs> this is well, the thing. The, you know this, about, this right? device comes with, uh, yeah, or, or, with, with, the, with these dark glasses. It does come with the dark glasses, but they do suggest that you actually, if you're going to put this on your face, cover your eyes completely with something that's dark, that it doesn't penetrate and the light doesn't penetrate. Question, how, how many times a week should, you, should we do it to the bird? Um, they recommend for humans three to four times a week. Um, for birds and animals, about the same if you're going to do in five minute increments. Okay. So All we're right. down to one minute, and I can feel the heat from the actual uh, circulation from the, uh, the bird's uh, blood going through the area that would not normally go through. And so this is really feeling really good for her, and I can feel that the feathers are nice and hot. Hmm. Remember, this is a cold laser, so a cold laser doesn't do any uh, heating, but the actual blood inside of the, the body will begin to, can, can to you, go up into the area and heat it up. You can feel it if you feel it, if you, if you put your hand on no, it. No, I don't want to take my hands over yeah. her face. But okay, can, can you ahead. open her wing? Okay, yeah. it, okay it's over. Put your, put your hand on it. Oh, yeah. Okay, so. There you go. It's not restricted anymore. Yeah, I still, I still don't want to pull it too much. Don't know? pull it too much, but it's, it's definitely not hurting her any, that much anymore. Yeah, well, the, the pain, I can vouch for the pain because I, of, with my knee, I just did my knee, man. Yeah. I'm like, my knee, you know, my it's shoulders, really good now, my hip. You know? <laughs> my hip, so it, it's really good. You know, Very just, good. The only thing, you just got to be consistent, okay? Yes. So this is uh, for your birds, guys. Again, this bird got attacked by a hawk. And, uh, you know, uh, her wing got a little messed up. So I, I don't know if she had gotten it out of there to fly yet. I really don't. Once I put it there, she just blends. Uh, I, I don't think she had gotten out of there to fly. But if she doesn't ever, I don't mind, you know, because I, I don't want her to be hurting. But she, she flies pretty good in there. So come on, follow me. We're going to put it. Okay? All right, so... We're gonna put it in there in the loft. Alrighty, so it's gonna help in my hand now. See, she's flying pretty good. You know, she's flying pretty good, guys. So, again, give me a laser. Uh, this is cold laser, okay? We're gonna put the link below. It's not a red light, it's, just, it's a laser, actually. And uh, when you press it here, okay, you press it, look, it's set for five minutes. I don't know if you see it there. Five, there you go. And then if you go like, like that, uh, see, that's 10 minutes, right? I don't know if you can see it. And then 
15. 15. 20. 25 and 30. But for the pigeon, uh, I, I believe you just, you just do it for five, guys. Five minutes. Okay, hey, I hope this bless you. And my wife is going to put the link where you can get this. So, hey, I hope this bless you. And you guys all have a blessed day. <laughs> we tricked them. Bye.